to another early morning meeting. I honestly don't know how people do this every day, or at least every weekday. It's one heck of a drive. I don't mind doing it, you know, when I'm up already. It just seems like quite a grind. After working for yourself at home, for the greater part of your adult life, I guess kind of spoils you. I got a really good photo of that sunrise on Instagram. It turned out nice. I'm starting to get more into taking photos there. I don't know why. I mean, I joined a lot of other photo networks of sorts and post the photos everywhere, but there's something that I guess is a bit more intimate. Intimate? That's not even a word. Okay, I need more coffee. Why, thank you, GPS, for telling me to do the thing I just did before you told me to do it. I'm not cranky. Honestly. Could you tell me more about ThinkSpace? Well, sure, there's tons of entrepreneurs and startups and small businesses in here. We have over 280 member companies. Well, you have 280. I didn't realize it was that many. Yes, tons. That's a few. We have companies that are individual solopreneurs all the way to funded companies. Our last company that came in here um, is Donuts, and they raised $100 million. Wow. That's really impressive. Oh, sorry, Peter. Someone needs you. Hey. I just wanted to say hi. This is his building. You know, it's really cool. Thanks. Yeah. They've never been in a vlog before. <laughs> They're virgins. We are. We are. Chris is going to steal that from us. Hey, see you tonight. Brand buddy. Big Brandon party. Yeah. Brandon. Brandon. But the problem is, is that this vlog won't be published until two days later. So oh. they'll have missed it. Oh. But they will experience it later on in this video. <laughs> Yo, it's going to be wild. Yo, lots of dicks. They didn't realize I was going to vlog them until like a second before I started vlogging them. We spent the greater part of this morning uh, talking about uh, web strategy, uh, and I know that's probably boring to many people, but it's it's uh, it's been an interesting industry to be in. As someone who does content, I want to do more content. I want to do more help and how-to. I want to uh, connect people with resources that they need, and you know, part of doing that is working with people like them who could take what it is that I'm doing and make it 10 times better. And that's the value of having an intelligent team of people around you. Now, I think the trees are brighter than those signs. It's 64 degrees outside and Diana left the house to get ice cream. Wow, yesterday we had a total of 211,000 minutes watched in this YouTube channel alone. Holy cow, that's ugh, insane. Is that you? Yeah. Okay, I realized that was a general question, but I just assumed that you would be the one to answer. And ordered the new Chromebook. It should be here within a week or so. I'll unbox it live on YouTube. I told you, October is shaping up to be a very expensive month for me, but since these companies don't send me the products to review, I have very little choice but to buy them because everybody wants to know my opinion on gadgets, so the only way to give them my opinion is to use the gadgets. And maybe in some ways, this is good for me. At least that's what I keep telling myself. Cool! We got a postcard from Chad Gregory. He's apparently been watching our vlogs. Unless someone else has vlogged the Minifig Series 8. It seems that more and more people are liking our content because our number of shares for videos is like way, way, way up. Like taller than me way up. So thanks everybody for telling your friends about the videos that we do for you guys on YouTube. Then of course the links on Locker Gnome. I got a package here from Tennessee. Oh, looks like a couple of Series 7 Minifigs. From Clemente and Sarah. Oh, maybe that's Clemente and Sarah. They say we're building the brand wearing the planet, obsolete planet. 
I'm not exactly sure what that means, but thanks for the minifigs. Yeah. You know how long it's been since I've been to the dentist? Years. They have new patient gifts. You can get gift cards or an iPod shuffle. That might work. Look what else came in the mail. My voting ballot. Ooh. Hmm. Yes or no? That is the question. We're off to the brand buddy party. Wicket, you cannot come. Sorry. <laughs> I remember my business cards this time. I don't always do that when I go to parties. I don't know how long we're going to stay because uh, it definitely seems more of like a nightlife type of thing and I am not a nightlife guy. This is how I go clubbing. Like this. Wearing my geeky t-shirt and fleece that is likely ready for retirement. Should I wear my band or no band? Should I keep it simple? Keep it simple, stupid, or? No, bling out, dude. Keep it blinging, you're, smarty. You're my arm candy. You're so cute. You're cute. Uh-oh, we can't kiss. Oh, it's, it's, I didn't know. Is it not a smudgeable? Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm sorry. But it's so pretty. Yeah. Yeah, because I have my chapstick on, too, and I don't want to get it all over you. Ah! guess it's still recording. My great-grandmother was a seamstress. She used to make oh, pretty much all of our outfits. Yeah, thanks for that, car. I knew I was going to go left, because I can't go right! <laughs> anyway. You want to know why I am opposed to wearing clothes that are uncomfortable? Her. She went and bought the cheapest, <laughs> itchiest fabric on the planet and used that. It was horrible, honestly. I'm, I, I'm, I've been traumatized for life. If, I, if I'm not comfortable, I won't wear it. You don't like the sheets um, stiff and... Yeah, like, no. Like, it's got to have a high thread dried. count. Yeah, no, I don't like anything that's not put in the dryer with a softener 13 times over. I like it when we stayed at your parents. I just love the smell of like fresh hung linens. Yeah, but you know that you can just, just get a like, spray for that. It you reminds don't... me of when I was little. It reminds me of when I was little too. <laughs> no thank you. <laughs> Life is too short to be uncomfortable and close. I'm this is it. Yeah. I don't care. Next left. Thank you, because I can't go straight. <laughs> no. Didn't get dark that quickly. Huh. We were in the tunnel. Actually, it's been getting dark uh, a lot quicker, right? Earlier in the day, yeah. Yeah. Because it's that time of year. We're on our way to the party that we referenced earlier in the day for a launch for a website, a service for brands called Brand Buddy. And I'm very interested in, in becoming more involved in that particular product. If only because I have dealt with so many brands over the years and have given them a lot of value. Think about the brands we talk about in the vlogs. People love knowing what we use every day. Proceed about three miles on I-90 West. Gotcha. Stop and go traffic. Really? <laughs> Can you guys tell that we've been walking in the rain for the past 10 minutes? Apparently we parked too far away. Yeah. I didn't think it would be bad. Oh, Diana blew a shoe. Yeah. I just got them too. Can you get a refund? You should be able to if you just got them. No, I got them at the thrift shop. That's a problem. Probably a reason they're at the thrift <laughs> shop. Brand buddy must have worked because we decided to stop by Dick's on the way home so that Diana's mom could have dicks for the first time. And this will be fresh and we can get fries and everything. Who's to say that social media doesn't have an ROI? Mm. Tell them how you got hit on tonight. I didn't get hit on. She was all over you. She was drunk, she'd have been all over anything. Diana's mom is having her first dicks downstairs. I'm going to head upstairs change into some drier clothes. You can't see me right now, but close your eyes and you can imagine what I look like at this moment in time. I'm back in my office, in the saddle, which is more like my chair. Got a bit of work to do before heading to bed. I'm gonna go ahead and add this clip to the end of this vlog. And let me just say before I do that, thanks for all your support.